So last week on Healthier Together, we featured a local stroke survivor's journey from diagnosis to recovery. And now we're learning how she's become an ambassador for the Go Red for Women movement to raise awareness of heart disease and stroke and inspire others to make healthy lifestyle changes. The Go Red for Women campaign revolves around raising awareness um, when it comes to heart disease and stroke, really just educating folks on what to look out for with our own stories. The Go Red for Women initiative is really expansive. We think about heart disease, cardiovascular health and wellness, as well as stroke. They all work together on one organ, which is our heart. And since I felt so alone throughout my recovery, I wasn't sure how to normalize, and when I reached out to American Heart Association that really changed my life in the sense that I finally found groups of people that had experienced strokes at relatively young ages and they're recovering or have recovered and they live a relatively normal life and so that taught me that you know it is possible to go back to normal as long as you're willing to be courageous and get back out there and so that's when I really um, started to heavily involve myself in the American Heart Association so started off volunteering at local events and then now I'm a Go Red for Women national ambassador hoping to you know just inspire other survivors to get back to where they were before. Be the Beat is the theme for this year. Our group here in the Puget Sound of leaders have gathered together to say the importance of CPR, especially as it's played out on the national stage uh, in the last few weeks, has become very, very important. And so we rallied around that theme of Be the Beat. Um, we are wanting to make sure that every household understands the importance of learning CPR. I learned um, CPR in ninth grade. I did not know that in 12 months I would actually be performing CPR in an individual who had had a heart attack. So the importance of just understanding what to do and the warning signs is really paramount. And I really think that the campaign itself, since it's founded upon education, um, is really easy to get involved in because all you have to do is share your story. And that's all I had to do really to, you know, bring awareness to other people that, you know, strange medical circumstances are going to happen, but you can prevent a major full bone stroke or you can save somebody's life through just knowing hands only CPR. And there's so many interventive ways that, you know, we could help each other. And I think it's important to do that. So that way, instead of being a bystander, we can continuously be the help. When you're hearing these stories, those are things that say, okay, I'm making a difference. I'm making a difference one life at a time. And that's really what propels all of us. And the leadership within the Go Red movement here in Puget Sound is phenomenal. And they are they are stories of, of happiness, sometimes unhappiness, but they're also the importance of why we're doing this every single day. And a reminder, you can find all of our Healthier Together stories at fox13seattle.com.